Um, I came here two years ago on my first trip to Hong Kong and one of the things I was shown was the so-called 10,000 Buddhas which was in June time when it was very very hot was a real struggle to climb and there was lots of renovation going um, and I thought I'd got up most of the way um, although I was sweaty and sticky and you know as you've seen on some of the photographs on my Flickr stream there are these 10,000 gold Buddhas on either side of the walk up the hill in fact there's some just left here so you can see these just across on uh, on the hillside but uh, I climbed this time uh, a lot higher and there I'm not going to get the, the camera to show you but behind is another temple and a, an old house and then this sort of temple here but the most amazing thing for me is when I was walking uh, up and I thought, well, how much higher can you go? I was walking past this red building, we'll come past this red building now, to find what I think is the most amazing thing about the whole hard journey. I'm a bit damp under the armpits, to say the least, and it's only late December. But come and have a look at this. This is absolutely amazing. This white Buddha. Now, I think you'll agree with me, this is worth the climb for. And especially when you don't know that it's up here, it's even more dramatic and I came up and thought well how many more gold Buddhas are there and I have to say I was speechless um, I don't know the, the relevance of it but I think it's really beautiful with the, the red stone in the hand the, the red spot on the forehead and of course the, the tongue now recently in Thailand uh, one of the tour guides said that about Buddhism to touch the tongue of the dragon was lucky so I suppose having the tongue of the dragon painted red is lucky as well but this is what you get when you come to Sha Tin Monastery uh, you go from Hong Kong take the uh, West Rail Line to Hang Hom change and then four stops up it's very easy to find and it's free one thing to bear bear in mind though um, although I didn't take any film of it there were a couple of monks in grey begging on the way in and I've now learnt that uh, you shouldn't pay the monks so that's DFB, MBE at this gorgeous white Buddha at the top of the hill at the 10,000 Buddhas, otherwise known as the Shatin Monastery.